वेलकम टू आर एन वाई इन साइड लर्निंग हाउ दिस इज द फोर्थ वीडियो ऑफ द सिलेनियम सीरीज इन दिस वीडियो वी विल कंटिन्यू विद द लोकेटर सो टूडे वी विल वी विल अंडरस्टैंड हाउ वी कैन इंटरेक्ट विद द एलिमेंट विद द सी एस एस सिलेक्टर ओके सो लेट्स बिगिन so i'm going my project and uh, now open uh, open okay now locator strategies in under the locator strategies i am going to create a package and package and css selector okay so and now i'm going to create a class okay so by c s s selector okay okay now so our target website is uh, facebook so i am now going to copy the setup path okay okay now <clears throat> okay now opening our facebook facebook okay so uh our test case is enter username enter a password and click on a login button and now enter username and password again and now click on login button again so both time we will enter a wrong credential okay this is just for you know understanding the concept of the uh, locator how we can achieve that okay so okay uh, actually i am using my mobile laptop mobile internet so that's taking a time so we will write a you know a script for that so now so first is in second okay so first css selector will be css selector rule for id okay for id okay so driver uh, we will first to navigate the driver dot manage dot window dot maximum okay driver dot navigate dot two dot url Driver dot find element by CSS selector. Okay. Now for ID, we are okay. Sorry, I'm logging in this and opening. second is taking too much time okay so email email is our now send keys okay send keys will help to uh, enter the tax in the input box okay so random email at the rate email dot com okay and now second is uh, css second css rule is uh, this is css css rule okay css selector rule is by <coughs> tag and id okay 
prepared an item okay so driver dot find element by dot css selector okay right input input box hashtag task okay so send keys find a random pass okay and third is third css selector rule is web tag name okay so driver dot find element y dot css selector right okay so uh, okay so name dot login so this is login button so login button is need to be clicked so i'm going to click okay now copy this okay Okay, for time save. Okay. okay, now the fourth is fourth CSS rule is tag tag with the tag with attribute name or attribute value okay attribute value so input input okay input place holder email or phone number okay. and the fourth is fifth is okay okay now fifth is fifth is uh, attribute or start with you can say start with okay start with okay so start attribute attribute start with attribute value attribute starting value okay starting value so now I'm going to type start with okay, pass okay and CSS sixth rule is we have so many rules so I, I just okay want to attribute second end with okay so attribute okay attribute okay dollar and attribute value attribute and value so, so id dollar or button okay so now i'm going to open this so guys i actually i'm using my uh, mobile network so that why is taking too much time sorry guys for that okay so now uh, i will demonstrate uh, you i will explain the code then uh, then we'll 
okay run it okay now right click on it okay as soon as you right click uh, and uh, you will get uh, you know option as per your browser okay then uh, click on inspect inspect so inspect element will uh, have, you know help to read your dom by your web page and with from the web, uh, dom you will get an element so uh, and get the particular element as per your requirement so uh, today we are we are targeting css selector so for now you can see that we have id we have email okay so first i use the for id so id we have email okay okay and uh, enter a, a random email ID. okay this is a wrong okay now now second targeted input box is password so now you can see that so tag name with id so tag name is our input box okay and id is pass okay pass so uh, input and pass okay and now the third rule is tag name so we uh, our next target is login button so login button is uh, tag name button is a okay so this is a tag name button is a tag name and okay tag name or uh, and login so tag name or login name or login okay so we can we can pass the tag name only okay we can tag name button only if we have only one button in a screen but now here we have our two button in a in a screen so that's why i uh, you know taking this option okay for particular okay so now the third one uh, fourth one is tag name with attribute and attribute value okay so uh, as soon as we enter you know click this and you you will redirect the wrong credential screen so we will redirect you can see so we we redirect here okay so as soon as we redirect here so i am try to uh, enter a credential again so here i am entering a credential again okay okay now the tag name with the attribute so you can see the inspect element again and the input box is a tag name input box is a tag name okay and the placeholder is my attribute placeholder is my attribute and close holder value is my attribute value okay so i am going to zoom this so you will you know easily see that one second okay so you can see placeholder placeholder is the attribute and uh, email or mobile email address or phone number is a placeholder value okay so what is a placeholder okay so in so many uh, beginner is not aware that is a keyword of this okay <clears throat> whenever he uh, they they face an interview then uh, then they will lack to understand okay so now one second so placeholder is nothing but is the identification of the any uh, any input box or any radio button or any you know any particular element to identify this so like that password is a placeholder of the password input box okay so i am using this and it's the last one start with so now so so start with this okay so start with this wow you can see that so uh, okay i am taking one second once okay so you can see one second so our targeted is password so type is attribute type is attribute so i am taking a attribute here one set attribute is a type and this attribute value start with pass so 
we will take the starting value okay okay so but but take care of the spelling or you know it is a typing error typing mistake okay so you now the third is target end with so now the third target is our uh, login button okay so login button is uh, mm, mm, this is password login button so you can see we have long text here so login button so the end text is button okay and id is a attribute so id is a attribute and button is a end text hope you guys uh, understand the concept what i'm trying to you know uh, uh, what, what i'm trying to demonstrate here okay so now i'm going to run this code so hope everything is uh, fine is take a uh, time as i am using my uh, mobile network okay one second uh, browser is launched facebook page is open and now enter a email address and enter a password click on a login button and enter email address and password again so something might be wrong my script gone failed okay why this why what the element is not found this element is not found okay why this element is not found okay as this element entered is not connected to an account find your and so we will get a message so now for achieve this we uh, we we enter we write something here one second some more code okay so one second web mm. element uh, username this is a username uh, i try to handle this okay so i am using a web element interface okay and uh, you name so first we need to okay uh, clear the text okay so clear clear uh, method help to clear the text which is entered is okay in our input box so you name dot uh, send keys right now you name dot uh, send keys and keys is uh, now I am using another email one second. Sunit K four four zero. This is my email dot com. So now, now okay. so Probably is launch. Sunit K four four zero will be entered. Yeah, perfectly fine. And now, uh, and okay, so email is uh, not for one second. Okay, why this color very deep? One second, email or phone number, uh, my something is missing in our code. One second, I am take. Is something is something is something is 
so now we click on that and uh, clear this okay and then now we have to click on this first so now i'm going to rename name dot uh, click okay so now one second effect element and inspect element and so the placeholder is email or one second oh 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 email or phone number uh actually the placeholder tax is wrong that's why we are getting an error again and again okay this is a wrong by mistake okay you can see silly mistake will you know will uh throw an error okay so please take care of this okay now right okay now run this code again hope this time will work okay so you have to uh you know you have to build the skill to read a console error okay so with the help of read a console error you will you will you know uh, uh resolve your issue okay so try to read a you know console error so now you, this time the email address is uh, right but why this password okay something is a uh, password illegal invalid selector exception clear and exception mm. okay now we will resolve this don't worry one second the exit issue is something else not this invalid selector exception but uh, here we are not selecting anything okay. so mm -hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. okay okay run again now run again run again this pointer is not moved in next input box okay this a uh, password is not one second one second one second guys i understand the issue one second pass actually the pointer is not moved to the next password screen and that's why we are oh, one second i will explain one second i will explain so uh, pass dot click dot and pass dot okay now run this run again so this time will run easily okay error bhi aana chahiye tha tabhi main ye situation based jo theory samjhana hota na wo alag hi maza hai isme no why the password that you enter is incorrect or forget okay 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 actually the password is entered but uh, the password is entered and click so that's why we are getting this okay in well twice specified third password is type pass something else one second actually manually we enter this and then click on this okay jab hum manually is pe click kar rahe okay to click on and enter and click on and enter so that's a one second or something else one password type is pass so 
Titans Pass. Okay. Okay, one second. Oh, oh. Silly mistake. Silly mistake. Silly mistake. Okay. The curly braces is missing from the tag. Okay. CSS selector. You can see that. The curly braces is missing. So now run this code again and now this time will was hope so okay ye bhi hona chahiye tha at this time will okay now perfectly our code is run okay you can see that now nothing is so hope guys i hope you have understand the concept of the css selector so okay so please watch this video again so you will get a concept easily okay so i hope you will like the video to show your uh, response please hit the like button and if you are new to this channel then please subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon to receive a notification for uh, upcoming or updated videos or i would be glad to receive your feedback suggestions and queries in the comment section comment is open for you guys you can uh, if you uh, support me then it's very helpful to me okay please share it with your network please share it with the uh, 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 with you know others this channel okay Thanks guys, thanks for watching.